I didn't want anyone to recognize me, so I employed the first of my Greta Garbo disguises. Concentrate on my work. I can't stop thinking about you. I oh, know, me too. Aren't you hungry? Eat is really good. <laughs> yes, I should eat before I go. What yeah. do you mean? I thought you could stay. No, I have to go home. Okay. I can get some time tomorrow afternoon. I'm sorry. This is as new to me as it is to you. But come with me to Paris next week. I don't have that much to do. We could spend the weekend in the country. What are we getting into here, Jerry? I think we're already in it. Present. It was that hair of yours that really did it for me. Right here. Everything work out all right? Smooth. The concierge at my hotel promises he won't tell the press I'm in town. Great. Nobody saw me either. So, let's have a fantastic meal. Tommy Sonny. When you do a love scene in films, do you find yourself getting involved? Getting involved? How do you mean? Well, you know, are the love scenes real? You mean physically? Yes. <laughs> well, they're real up to take 25. And then after that... <laughs> and after that, they fall off dramatically. <laughs> Oh, my God, there are four English journalists over there. So we're having dinner, so what? I don't want to read about this in the papers back home. Oh, no. Jerry. Well, hello, Jerry. How nice to see you. <laughs> Miss McLean, what brings you to Paris? Well, we're working on a project which I hope pans out. Ah, trying to solve the problems of the world, eh? <laughs> <laughs> well, yes. How do you think the vote will go on the nuclear freeze question next week? Just give me a moment here, will you, and I'll come over and discuss it with you. Good. Nice to see you. Nice to see you. Jerry, stop acting so strange. People can be friends. I think we should proceed at a slower pace. All right. 
Whatever you say. I'm going to have to spend some time with them. Now? Tonight? What about us tonight? I wouldn't be very good company. I need to think. I... Listen, why don't I just leave Paris and we can see each other sometime again in the future? No, I don't want you to go. Do you know Saint Germain en Laye? Yeah. yeah. Meet me there at that small hotel. There's anyone. When? Tomorrow. Jerry. But when you started this relationship with me, didn't you know that anything public would be difficult? No, not really. I suppose I didn't think. <coughs> Guess I'll just go. You tell them I have an engagement or something, and you do what you have to do. Yes. All right. Thank you. It's really been wonderful. My pleasure. Thank you. I stood there asking myself, what is this mysterious attraction? And how much was I willing to put up with to find out? Well, we've got plenty of time to get to the airport, dear. Yes, it's a beautiful spot. Big pleasure. breakfast? No. Can you find your way back, all right? Sure. I found my way back from wilder places than the French countryside. There you have. I think you better hang on to this. The room we had brought to life for that weekend came to a silent stop. The walls closed in on me. Neither one of us had even mentioned the word love. 
I didn't want anyone to recognize me, so I employed the first of my Greta Garbo disguises. Concentrate on my work. I can't stop thinking about you. I oh, know, me too. Aren't you hungry? Eat it's really good. <laughs> yes, I should eat before I go. What yeah. do you mean? 